As you spend more time coding in Klein, you might eventually come to a point that ends up disrupting your flow. It can be anything from running out of context window or checking GitHub's latest pull request. And ideally, you'd like to stay within the chat for as long as possible. Slash commands are designed to help you stay engaged in coding. And mastering these commands can help your productivity with Klein without needing to leave the chat. So let's take a look at each one of them. Starting with small. Small is a slash command that condenses your entire context into a smaller size. Klein is instructed to preserve key components components of your interactions and summarize them into smaller chunk. This comes in handy with certain LLMs where the context window is small. You simply type in the command for slash small and Klein will condense all your interactions. This can be repeated over and over again, which means repetitive tasks or exploratory tasks can be done in Klein without having to rebuild your entire context. Moving on to new task. New task is very similar to small where it also summarizes your entire chat history, but instead it results in spawning a new task in Klein. A good way to think about it is using a paint palette. The small command condenses your palette by removing colors that just aren't useful for the current canvas you're painting, while the new task command not only condenses your palette but also hands you a fresh canvas, so you can keep using the same colors you already mixed without having to recreate them for the new task at hand. This is how it looks like in Klein. The new task command will create a brand new task card with a condensed summary for you to continue iterating with. Let's move on to workflow. Workflow is a slash command that gives you the ability to run tasks on demand. It can be anything from checking pull requests on GitHub, messaging your coworkers in Slack, or even publishing a new release. You can start by clicking this button, giving the workflow a name, and Klein will create a markdown file for you to edit. Using Klein to generate its own workflow can be a great way to save time. You can do this by using the at symbol to refer to the workflow you just created and briefly describing what you would like it to do, and Klein will start building the workflow on your behalf. You might be wondering, what is the use case for this? A good way to think about it is every time you find yourself leaving the chat to do something else, think to yourself whether it makes sense to build a workflow for it. Finally, we have the new rule slash command. New rule is a way to instruct Klein to create its own rule to adhere to. And this command tells Klein to draft the markdown file and place them directly into the Klein rules section. You can start by typing in forward slash new rule, followed by a brief description of the rule you're trying to create. You can continue refining these rules by using the app symbol to refer to a specific markdown file and instructing Klein to modify them as you go. By keeping a list of well-defined rules, your experience with Klein will naturally improve. And the slash commands all work in harmony to keep your productivity sustained without disrupting your flow.